recent settlement, $880 million to be paid out to 1,353 victims of sexual assault at the hands of the LA Catholic Church. Cases that have taken place decades ago, et cetera, et cetera. So let's tell the whole story. So about four years ago, in the year 2019, Assembly Bill 218 was passed in California. This, for a three-year window, took away the statute of limitations for anybody to come forward with accusations of sexual misconduct with a minor. Any civil cases about that, which brought forth a lot of people who had accusations against the LA Catholic Church, which is the shock bear. This is not the first settlement they have. Had. They had a recent settlement before this settlement of seven hundred and seventy million, and this one is now eight hundred and eighty million, which brings the whole grasp of how many times their whole settlement is to one point five billion that they settled in 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 this to be paid out to the victims. And I don't know how that process takes place, or like if they're cutting a check, is it direct deposit? Which I'm not trying to be funny. I just don't know. What was interesting was when I was reading about this story was about the people who were accused of sexual assault when kids would come forward and say, hey, this man molested me with you a whoop, they would either be moved to a different church or go to counseling, quote unquote, be moved to a different community. I've read one article saying that a lot of the times they would be moved to Catholic churches and immigrant communities where their abuse could still take place again because, you know, who's going to listen to the immigrants and the minorities would do a whoop. My thoughts on all of this, I think they're sick as fuck. I think it's... You know, there are so many, and, I, and and to be fair, to be fair, I see the LA Catholic Church that I checked out their website. I see them trying to push and show that they're trying to change and see that they're trying to make changes. I see that, but it just hurts my heart that these people are supposed to be the figureheads and the key.